Hey guys, this is Gonsham. Welcome to World Trending News. Grand National, Racegoers and Electric Return. Racegoers are preparing for an electric Grand National as they return to the popular steeplechase for the first time in three years. The entry event was cancelled in 2020 due to the coronavirus pandemic, before resuming last year behind closed doors. This year's event was sold out with 70,000 punters at the Liverpool course for the main race. Spectator Gabriella Nielsen, 27, said, We have missed it so much. It's such a good day for everyone to get together. She added, When you win, it is the best feeling ever. The first female jockey to win the Grand National was riding on Manila times again after their victory in 2021. Stephen Baird, who was attending with his family from Glasgow, said, Today is going to be electric. We want to see Rachel Blackmore win in person this year. He was joined by his sister Nikki and their father George after they initially planned to come for his 70th birthday in 2020. Ms. Baird added, We're so excited to be here. I think it's 100% going to be extra special this year, it has to be. Among those attending are former Liverpool FC manager Sir Kenny Dalglish and sports broadcaster Chris Kamara. Rachel Carhart, from Prescott, was at Aintree for her 10th time, adding, I love it, it's my favourite day. The atmosphere is amazing. While newcomer Ian Hares, 36, said, I've been watching the Grand National on the television all through my life and I have always wanted to be here so it is a massive thrill. Bookmakers predict a total of more than £150 million will be wagered on the contest with UK betting shops open again on National Day after the lifting of coronavirus restrictions. This is Gansham, welcome to the World Trending News. If you want to more update regarding around the world trending news, then subscribe our channel and press the bell icon and share with your friend and family. Thank you very much for watching our video. Thank you.